Hello and welcome to this MAMP, the free edition screencast. Today uh, I'm going to be talking about the preferences in MAMP, the free edition. I'm going to be using OS X Yosemite and MAMP 3.072. Okay, so with the free edition you have uh, several preferences which you can set uh, and separated into four tabs here. Uh, the first tab is the start-stop options. Um, pretty self-explanatory. Uh, when starting MAMP, you can have the server start out automatically. That's uh, convenient. Uh, this one here, check for MAMP Pro. If you have been using MAMP for a while and you move on to MAMP Pro, you can uh, check this uh, checkbox. So if you accidentally do click on the gray elephant here, you'll get a reminder that you do have MAMP Pro installed. Open the web start page automatically. Uh, if you have this checked, the uh, your web start page right here will automatically open up in your uh, default browser. And down here, when quitting MAP, you can stop the servers as well, which I guess is another uh, convenience thing. My favorite link uh, is going to be explained in the uh, open web start page and advanced features uh, screencast. So uh, over here uh, on the next tab, we have ports. And your default uh, MAMP ports are 8888 for Apache, 7888 for Nginx, and 8889 for MySQL. They're uh, different than the, I guess, default uh, web uh, standards for Apache, Nginx, and MySQL. Uh, they are different in MAMP, just so in case you had some other DAC software already installed. They were probably running on port 80 when 3306 and uh, we didn't want any conflicts right off the bat. Um, you might want to change this to 803306 um, if you're running WordPress or something like that. Uh, a lot of times if you were uploading your site from or, uh, uh, or downloading your site from um, a host provider it was probably running on port 80 your wordpress so if you uh, download your website that was running on a host provider wordpress in particular and it doesn't work um set it to port 80 and see if that's going to get it 80 and 3306 and see if that get it gets it working php the free edition comes with two versions of php uh, the pro version will come with five standard and the ability to add some more so here's your choice on the free version between the two uh, PHP versions. These change uh, on a version basis. Um, caching options, certain content management systems uh, work better with different caching options. So if your website's running a little slow, you might wanna uh, do some research on that and set one of the caching options. The last option here that you can change is your uh, the web server tab. You can change your uh, web server. In MAMP, the free edition, we have Apache and Nginx available. Uh, most of you are going to use Apache, but you can uh, try Nginx if you want. It's a more specialized uh, web server for static data. Down below here, we have the document root for your local host. This is where the uh, this is the directory we, where you're going to put your website files. By default, in um, MAMP, uh, it's defaulted to Applications MAMP HT Docs. I would recommend to change out of that and uh, put a uh, hosts directory in maybe inside of your documents. Here, I have a. Uh, this host uh, directory is uh, in my documents folder and here I have a bunch of hosts and that way it's outside of the applications MAMP folder so when I do an update I don't have to move my hosts around so I just clicked OK there and my server's restarted and uh, that's how you can change your settings on your document route. Um, there is more information about uh, your document route in the uh, setting up my first website with MAMP screencast. And that's going to do it for the preferences in MAMP.